sing with me. Let's go. From Monday to Friday, from Friday to Sunday, show Nigella how are you going I am so good Ruckus how are you I am alive and well and I'm excited about this because the song <laughs> is the song is energy and the song is vibes yeah I'm telling you it's cool but then the heat already starts in the <laughs> studio that's what we're there. talking about all right <laughs> so um let me start by I, I saw on your on your bio on your on your profile on, on IG rather that you have both St. Lucian flag <laughs> and Trinidad and Tobago flag I need to know which one you identify with. Oh my goodness. Now you see the, the beautiful thing about Trinidad and Tobago. It's just like a pillow, mm -hmm. just like St. Lucia. It's something called a buyo. Everything right. mixed up together yeah. to create something tasty, right. enticing, and beautiful. Right. So I was born in a beautiful honeymoon destination <laughs> <laughs> island of St. Lucia. But I've been living in Trinidad and Tobago for closely to 14 years now. Okay. Approximately. I wonder if there's train all in St. Lucia to say that when all they go anywhere, boy. Because that is John the same way. <laughs> it's a national pride and it's inculcated within yeah. us. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm happy yes. to hear that. How have you been enjoying Trinidad? Why you come here? Well, I came here to study. Mm -hmm. And why Definitely. you never leave? Oh, I loved it. <laughs> <laughs> and I keep on going home mm -hmm. every summer, every Christmas, and so on. All right. So I decided to... But you keep to... coming back. Yeah. How has your journey been so far in this gospel music industry? It has been a beautiful journey. I started singing in St. Lucia. Mm -hmm. And of course, I decided to take a little break and just work behind the scenes in Trinidad. Right. Decided to do my MBA and my ACC accounting studies. But then now launching back Indeed. into gospel music. And I'm loving it. Yeah. How was the, uh, the IREP show you, you took? Part in the IREP show last oh, week. How was it? It was very exciting to be able to see all different Caribbean countries um, represented. And of course, I need to say thank you to the St. Lucia government, which endorsed me. <laughs> um, and it was great to see my peers from all different countries representing hard yeah. for Jesus. You know, it's very interesting. Somebody told me that they were looking at the at, at some of the um the gospel shows over the weekend, and they were they were a bit concerned because you know we have mm. all this energy, all this vibes, and all you know that that's good. Yeah. But along the way, they felt as though the message was getting lost somewhere. How really? do you feel about that? I believe that the message is more than ever potent, mm -hmm. strong, and clear. Music came from God in the first place. And I believe that if there's someone in Africa who has a message to share, mm -hmm. they're not necessarily going to speak Chinese or Spanish. They will speak what is part of their culture and right. showcase that. Right. And especially in the Caribbean, we have so much culture and it's rich. Mm -hmm. So let us use the reggae, let us use the soca, which is indigenous to us, and let us express that in a beautiful way through music. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, let's stop people from whining to, to soca. <laughs> Because it's, it's be a thing that has happened that baseline. <laughs> you just can't help yourself, right? If you're training, your, your waist is, he doesn't control it. Like, he doesn't have no control. Your waist is automatically moved. I hear you, moved. I hear you, I hear you. But then it's all about the lyrical content. Right. It's all about the clear message mm -hmm. of Jesus Christ and inspiration. We need it all over the Caribbean. We need it in Trinidad and we Tobago. We definitely do. I, I understand you've been doing some work with Jaron Yes. You and Jaron <laughs> seem to have a very interesting partnership of, of music. Yes, yes. Jaron has been very inspirational to me, and we actually embarked upon a project last year during the COVID-19 period, mm -hmm. where we just wanted persons to showcase a little bit 
bit of one of my songs. Right. And Jaron and I partnered together, whereby persons would have received gifts from his two companies, mm -hmm. uh, Jesus Youth Apparel and also in Common Rights. Nice one. All right. So and you continue to do work with Jaron? Yes, I do. All right. He is one who definitely loves to nurture a lot of upcoming artists. So big up you, Jaron Luce, and big up to all the others who nurture us. And forgive me if I don't, I didn't get the results, but I know that you were nominated for two yes. awards yes, in, yes, in the yes, Gospel yes. Music Awards. How, yes. did, how did that go? Well, I ended up reaching to the finals. Right. I did not win this time around, but all I'm right. so proud to see that this song has made it all over the world. Mm -hmm. In Africa, they're reaching out, and it has made it on UK charts, nice. US charts, mm -hmm. and they're reaching out to me, even without me sharing the song. So that says a lot about the message in, in the, the music. In the music. Yes. And the vibes as well. And the vibes on top. The on vibes. Point <laughs> <laughs> I was going to give us some more before we get to the top of the hour. Let's that's right go. With you, yeah? Ladies and gentlemen, I want to reach out to each and every one of you and encourage you to make a difference today now because together we aspire. And if together we perspire, then together we most definitely can achieve. On behalf of Shamla, on behalf of Natasha, on behalf of Kimberly, I'm Rockers wishing you a fantastic Tuesday today. Please be safe. Enjoy the day. And the entire team, we want to wish you a great day today and make sure that you're covered under the blood. There we go. I we have rocks at the top of the hour with your news, so stay tuned. Yes, make sure you're covered under the blood of Jesus. Raise your hand right now and work in the kitchen. And let's go say, from Monday to Friday, from Friday to Sunday, Friday! 